say what's happening. The good news is we're all going to die. <laughs> Ain't that some shit? <laughs> Hey, but in the meantime, you got to understand that. Maybe you want to woke up to something, woke up to the world that we're living in right now, man. It's it's uh, Russia, China, and all those things, man. I tell you what, uh, I'm pretty excited uh, from a biblical standpoint what's taking place. Uh, but at the same time, my heart's breaking, surveilling for the world, all the good people that's going through all the hell that's going on. I'm telling you what, until we stand up for what's right and stand behind the good people when bad shit's going on, the devil comes to kill, steal, and destroy. And if that's taking place, I'm telling you what, we're not going to stand up for it. Uh, that's my opinion. I believe in righteousness. I believe in the heavens are behind us. If you're doing good, living good, and being good to your neighbor and stuff like that, you do the right thing. Otherwise, we're going to beat the shit out of you. <laughs> that's what I think. You know, now that's just my opinion. Uh, but that's the way it is in the real world. If you don't realize how bad things are right now, what's going on in this planet that we're living in and get outside of your own little purview of what we're seeing around us in America where it's safe and easy and we think everything's supposed to be Twitter, Instagram, Facegram, uh, Facebook, whatever, you know, the hell you're on, a rumble, you know, whatever the next thing, you know, uh, it's all comes down, hey, we're getting ready to pass a church right here, you know, people going to start remembering that cross when the bombs are falling and, you know, I've, I've prayed for our world and i prayed for our neighbors and each other that we have a bigger open mind of what's really going on. Uh, my heart's aching for the people uh, in the Ukraine and stuff like that. I know most Americans are like that too. Uh, we are noble people and we stand up for good things and righteousness and things like that. And when the devil and people that are doing bad things, just like there's good people and godly people around the world that do good things, uh, you know, we're going to stand with the godly people. We're going to stand with the people that are trying to help people, not destroy things and tear things down. We're trying trying to build things up. And that's just the way I feel. We gotta love one another through all this, but at the same time, we gotta overcome evil with good. And the only way you can do something like that in this world stage is God said that, man, we would destroy ourselves. If we're left up to ourselves, that's what we are, man. We're dogs, we hate each other, man. We let the devil take over our minds and little things, man. The, the world powers, you look at the world powers and the controls and those things like that, people go ape shit crazy. And, uh, you know, I don't like those kind of things, and I stand against those kind of things. But only God can save us. Only God's going to intervene. And you see all these things with Russia and China. I mean, there's going to be blood, man. I'm telling you what, and I hate it. I mean, if, you, if your travel's in the wintertime like it is right now, it's those people over there that are suffering. You know, man, it's terrible, man. And I tell you what, it, it's, it's going to come to an end. It's going to come to an end quick. And uh, you see all these systems taking place and coming together, and it's exciting, but it's very, it's very uh, sobering uh, to look through the lens of what the Lord is looking through and seeing how this world is imploding. Uh, and He's going to intervene at the end. Uh, but in the meantime, man, we in, we on front row seats, man. We on the historical timeline of seeing wars, ruins of wars. Famines, pestilence, and we don't think about all this stuff. We just think about all the good we got because of all the people that's laid down their lives for us and all the crazy stuff we've done. You know, so God's going to judge us all, man, and uh, we've got to be aware of what's going on. I'm praying for you. Uh, be aware that this could be the last day on earth for you, man. Make things right with your neighbor and good, and man, we're not going to stand up for bad. Pray for the people of Ukraine and all the good people of the world, even us as Americans, that our hearts are right and that we're doing things. The heavens are watching everything we do. Let's honor honor him. And I tell you what, he's going to honor it. He's going to come back and I'm telling you what, he's going to bust some knuckles, buddy. <laughs> hey, I love you, man. Let's pray for one another.